Okay, so I've drawn a ribbon that loops around. I got just two twists here. Um, if I was to do it over again in practice, or on my final project, I'd probably put a twist, another twist somewhere, just to add interest. Um, but, it's just practice. Now I'm going to show you how to make two ribbons loop. So, the first step is, make sure when you draw your first ribbon, that you draw it lightly, because eventually you're going to have to erase it. Part of it, I should say. So what I'm going to do, is I'm going to start down here, I'm going to have one ribbon come off from somewhere else, and I'm going to have it meet up and stop because it, you know, is going under it. And it's going to, you know, I want to make sure I know where it's going to pick up. So I kind of mentally say, I'm not drawing now, I'm just moving my pencil, like what direction this would go. And then that's where I'm going to begin again. And the thing is, is now I got to go on top of the other ribbon. And here's where I kind of wish I drew lighter. Now I drew a little darker to show up on camera. Um, so I'm not going to get as good of an erase as you. Um, but I'm going to have to erase, for right now, I know I'm going to have to erase this little bit of line here for now. So then I can go ahead and firm this up because I know I have to see this because it's going on top. I know that this line starts here and then I kind of make sure I can see that to where it starts and then I can also make sure I erase a little bit more fully. Okay now I need to do the side. Now I don't know if I'm racing here or here until I finish drawing the ribbon. So I'm going to start on this side and I'm drawing my ribbon going up Hey, there's a new technique. So you can go across, you can go down, you can loop around. You can also have your ribbons go vertical. All right, so I'm on this side. Alrighty, remember you want to gradually get thinner. And oh, I'm going to just say that, that it met there, oh, right about there, back up. Okay, so I guess it's this side. It's not the underside that it came out on. Can't always plan that. Now that means if this new ribbon down here goes under it, then it's going over it. That means that this line right here needs to disappear because it's invisible, because it's being covered up, because we don't have x-ray vision. And these ribbons are not see-through. They are solid fabric. And we do not have x-ray vision. So again, any stray marks you want to get rid of. Now, if you kind of like want to try another one and, you know, this one you know you're not real happy with the placement of it or, you know, you made a mistake, you don't have to bother erasing it. You just get another paper, but do not throw it out. Keep it as part of your practice. So now, you back this up a little better so we can see the whole thing. You have, something in your way, you have a ribbon going through it an opening. And you know, I could even had it loop back around and go under and come back on top of this. Um, and that might be interesting. So let's try that. Um, we'll come back through here. It would go under. It would stop here because you wanted to go under. And I'm just going to have it go under this side. I'm not going to try going on top because it's a little tight right now and I don't know that we're going to have the skills for that. But I could have it come on top here so it looks like it goes over, under, through. And then I would bring this around and finish the ribbon. And I'm holding the camera now which makes drawing so much harder. Oh, I think I have to teach you a new skill now because I just found a place to do it. All right, so again, drawing under, then over, then under, and I stayed under again, stayed behind there, but I could have it come back on top by drawing this over. That means I have to erase this part that goes under it. And that means I accidentally kind of erased the part that I wanted to go over. And then 
this has to be under there. And we'll talk more about shading next week, so I'm not going to get into shading too much. But, again, it started going under. I stopped. I didn't draw here. and But when I go over, I have to erase the part that it goes over. And then I can go under, and I can go back over. So now it's twisted. So, under, over, under, over. Try it. 